What's up, everybody? We're gonna hop right into this uh, no no music video remix. Oh, bitch. You see, let me just say, let me just say what I was gonna say is that we swore a remix was coming. We swore our remix was coming. And we lied to ourselves. We lied. We're spreading rumors. We're trying to, like, we, we think we have proof. We're like, Lil' Kim is managers, ex cousin, boyfriends, best friend's son liked this. And so, therefore, that means a remix is coming. No, we lied. We lied. We lied. We lied. So, there is no remix. And that's fucking fine, bitch. But even I fooled myself. I mean, I literally just introduced this as the remix video, and it absolutely is not. But let's just hop right into this uh, music video and see what the fuck she's serving us for a no no, which took, by the way, way too goddamn long. This album came out in November, bitch. Why have we not had a single since? But it's okay. I think this is a great single for springtime anyway, so this is like actually perfect timing. So let's hop right into this. Where is that? Yes. Ah. Okay, we're loving the colors, we're loving the outfit, we're loving the hair, the makeup, looking gorgeous. These dresses, this is something got sass, something got attitude. No more. Okay, I'm loving the wood, we're dancing on the subway. No, 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 no. We're loving the energy, the vibe. Diversity all over the place. You should've known what We got the whites, we got the blacks, we got the Asians, we got the Spanish. I don't have a thing I already been through. Dude, you better flip over that. Let's get Mariah doing that, bitch. No, no, that's a no, no. No, no, I said no, no. You know she is not gonna move from that spot. She's not gonna give us a dance. And that's okay. She's giving us diva. She's giving us attitude. Ooh, not the quotation. Oh, the sick whip. I really don't care. I mean, you better get that hand off that pole because that is dirty, bitch. If we're in the city. This song is so, it's so fucking good, guys. I mean, come on. This music video, not really going anywhere, but <laughs> that's okay, bitch. I said no, no, no. Not the Caution album promo. I'm loving the colors. It's fitting with the theme of the album cover, which we love. We love a good aesthetic. I mean, she's looking gorgeous. I'm loving the sassiness, but I want her to do a little one-two step. She's not going to give it to us. Every day of the week. Okay, these boys are cuties. Okay, she's about to fuck us up, huh? I want her. I want her to lift these words, kind of. I said no. I said no. Look. <laughs> I love that bitch. I love that. She said, no, no, we are not getting a new location in this video set. <laughs> That's... The bitch, these notes. Are we all hearing these whistle notes? That was iconic. She's translating on her hand, I'm dead. Can we get some more high notes? I want... Okay, why wasn't that a part of the album version? Oh my gosh, that sounded incredible. Okay, so let's give our overall conclusionary thoughts here. Okay, music video. I feel like... You know what? I, I usually would want more set, like more a different environment, like a little switch up here and there, but I feel like this worked. I felt like... The song with the with the neon colors, the subway, the dancing, her attitude. She was really giving you faith. She was giving you charisma. She was really performing the song. I feel like she's giving you looks. You know, lots of gifs can come from this. I felt like it was just like a part. Like it was giving you camaraderie. It was giving you very come together, blast the song, and have some fun, girl. Very urban while being very poppy and fun with all the vibrant colors. So I feel like normally. I'm not a fan of a one scene kind of going nowhere video, but I felt like it worked. It really worked. It was just very upbeat. It was very entertaining to watch for me. Like, I wasn't bored even with the fact that it really went nowhere. I felt like it was very entertaining to watch. 
Okay, so love that. I wish she hit us with a little one-two step, kind of maybe dance with the people a little more interactive, but it's okay. It's okay. I felt like definitely better than... I liked it better than the other two videos. Like, Get the Fuck Out was real, was very luxurious, cute, like very pretty, gorgeous, sex, boobs everywhere. But this one was just more fun, I, you know what I mean? So, okay, great. Um, whistle notes, we fucking love. Let me explain to you, I feel like the conclusion to the song, like the climax after the, after the, he's a slut, he's a hoe, he's a freak, after that part, and then it hits the final chorus where we're getting all these ad libs and shit, and the beat goes harder, I felt like, was so incredible already, and I felt like I wish it was more like that in the other choruses as well, but now you're gonna hit us with the whistle notes too? Like, now you're giving us a perfect conclusion. Like, that whole last 30, 40 seconds of the song is like fucking heaven to my ears, and now we got the whistle notes making it even better. So, I'm happy, definitely happy. I feel like this should be a huge spring smash, and I think we could still, they should still try to make that remix happen. Maybe they were trying to, and that was the whole delay in getting the single out, but and then it just didn't happen but i feel like let's try to make it happen for the spring and then maybe in the summer we can get a remix video right so, let's see i feel like that's a good idea uh y'all let me know what you thought of the video what you think of that new whistle note uh climax which we're, we're fucking living for um and that's it y'all thanks for watching subscribe for more follow me on twitter do what you gotta do peace out